Hi, I'm Dave Adams with TJ and the Jesus Network. It is time to change the planet. And what you're seeing here is Serve Inc. A serve in the name of Christ. It's an outreach here in Albany, Oregon, as people are coming together and serving their community. They do this on a fairly regular basis, as you can see. In the video that people are uh, getting set up for this, they're gonna have a bounce house for the kids. and all different kinds of events. And we're gonna be doing some live uh, webcasting from here, telling you what Serve Inc. is all about and maybe talking to some of the fine organizations that have linked up with Serve Inc. Again, we are webcasting live from Albany, Oregon today. Oregon National Guard, Color Guard is here to present the colors, bounce house for the kids. And we're gonna, they're gonna be here until about two this afternoon. But we're also gonna be doing some reporting from Corvallis, Oregon, where Cycle Oregon is located and they're having an event there as well today. I'm Dave Adams, this is TJN, the Jesus Network. Looks like we're about ready to get some announcements. What a joy and a privilege it is to serve together with you. And uh, in fact, would you find, just look at the person next to you and say, I am so glad I get to be with you today. I want to. Uh, I want to introduce somebody right off the bat that has a special role he was not even aware of. It's our cameraman, Don Dick. Because I want to thank our sponsors. <laughs> and they're right here. The, no, no, face me. So face me. Yeah, that's right. Uh, Allied Waste and uh, Watching and Best Pots and um, Bull Shark Trucking and Clay DeLue, Hoss Edward Jones and... Ooh, Don David and Associates, uh, Express Personnel, Issues, Bike Soda International, Minuteman Press, Northwest Natural Gas, Pepsi, Security Alarm Corporation, Stop and Go Markets, Team Challenge, Van Fleet Meat. Yeah, yeah, there's, that was it. Special thanks to our fire department and Aaron's and Ben Hickenlooper and Fitzpatrick Painting and Jefferson Rental and Larry Crawford Construction, our hairstylist, Parish Nurses, Premier Estate Homes, Salvation Army, Sunbelt Rental, Trinity Custom Homes, Little Brothers Construction. Let's just say thank you to them. And, and two key sponsors that helped make all this possible was somebody named Anonymous and Bertram Metals. Let's say thank you to them for what they contributed to make this a, a possibility. And most of all, I want to say thanks to you. Like I say, 20 churches plus other religious organizations uh, represented here. We have community people. We have people from the neighborhood. It's just, Albany is a wonderful place to live. Isn't that true? This is why. And I want to part the C's here. We can part the C's and make a line for the colors to come forward.
Thank you for everyone coming out tonight, or this morning actually. Uh, we're the 224 engineers here in Albany, and we want to be uh, the color guard to represent the colors. This flag which we honor and under which we serve is the emblem of our unity, our power, our thought, and our purpose as a nation. It has no other character than that which we give it from generation to generation. The choices are ours. Francis Bellamy wrote the Pledge of Allegiance in August of 1892. Since then, there have only been two changes to the Pledge of Allegiance, the last in 1954 by President Eisenhower, where he added the part, under God. So with that, please remove your headgear and place your right hand over your heart and follow me in the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. just pray real quick. Don, are you right here? Why don't you come on up? We're going to pray. So uh, you may want to take your hats off again or whatever you normally do. But we're going to honor the Lord and, and address Him. Let's pray together. Our Heavenly Father, how good it is to be here this morning together under the banner of the, Your name. And Lord Jesus Christ, we just pray that You'll be with us today as we serve and give a cup of cold water in Your name. And Lord, bless each and every worker. Keep us safe. Keep us energized, and Lord, as we finish this project, all the glory will go to you. Thank you for this day. What a beautiful day. We love you in your name. Amen. 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 Well, let me uh, give you some instruction here today. Rule number one for the entire day, and you need to practice this, is to smile real big. Uh, in fact, why don't you just look at your neighbor and just see if there's... there's now, that, 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 you got to show a little bit of teeth. A little bit of teeth. Yeah, yeah. Smile big. That's rule number one, because this is a happy day. This is a great day to serve together. Um, and so we're going to, it's just a joy and a privilege to do this. And we just got to remember that. This is, a, this is an honor to serve the Lord in this way. Uh, the guys in red shirts should have answers. If they don't have answers, they can direct you to people that have answers. And so they'll give you instructions. We have a... a project managers, uh, some lead contractors, and then wall leaders, all wearing red shirts. And in just a moment, in fact, if our wall leaders even now would come and line up across the front here uh, with your numbers. And so in a moment, we're going to divide up uh, as painters uh, with each of our wall leaders. And then the landscapers are going to join over here with uh, Andy, if you're going to come and join, and Ben, if you're here. And so the landscaper is going to be over on this side. You won't have a number, but on this other side of the flag. So if uh, everybody else could stand up here, got your number, and you guys are going to spread way out. So there's lots of room in between all of you because uh, 
because then people are going to line up behind you in just a minute. There are six sections of the building that we're going to paint today. Uh, walls number one through six, they're actually not walls, we're calling them sections. Some of them are just walls, but some are two or three walls. And each of those six uh, walls will have a team. And that's you, and you're going to be standing here in just a moment with one of these team leaders, and they're going to take you then to that wall where there are going to be donuts for you, uh, and then also that's where you're going to get uh, your instructions specifically for your wall, as well as uh, the painting equipment and the paint that you need for the day. Those uh, team leaders will provide instructions once you get there, so, so you don't need to ask a whole bunch of questions right away because your team leaders probably have the answers for those questions once you get to the section that you are building or it's not building painting now I just want to point out though that team number two well hold up your sign number two over there Brett, thank you that wall is like a gajillion windows it's the wall of windows with lots and lots of trim and so we're going to need more people in that line than we are in some of the other lines. Where's wall number five? We probably need the least number of people in wall number five, correct? Is that, is that five or is that, no, four, number four, excuse me, sorry about that. Uh, number four, probably not quite as many people. So before you leave, before we dismiss, we're gonna dismiss by group in just a couple of minutes. We'll, we wanna make sure we have the right number of people set up for each section, so that way we can be efficient, everybody can work and be productive today. Lunch will be about 1 o'clock. It will be right here. Um, and each wall, though, may or may not be completed before lunch. And so that means we, we, we got to stay. Some of us, at least, have to stay till it's done. And, and here's, here's a rule about that. There's nobody to clean up after us. We're it. We're the crew. Look around you. Okay? We're it. And so, uh, uh, so that means a, a wall is done. The project is done. When everything is cleaned up and put away and neat and tidy and ready for kids to come to class, okay, that's when we're done. And so we just need your help through that a whole day. And then at 2 o'clock today, that's when we're going to start tearing down this section. There is a children's program and services available for people from 9.30 until 2 o'clock out here. And at 2 o'clock, we still need some volunteers to come and help put away the, all these tents and tables and chairs as well as clean up after the, the painting project. So just so you're aware of that, we're going to need help here as well. With, with the painting, the things that we really have to be careful of are the brickwork. We want to tape that off really well. Your wall instruct, leaders will give instruction regarding that. And paint color, all the metal is brown, all the base is beige, all the trim work on the top on the edges are, is going to be brown, the doors are brown, but your wall leaders know that. Make sure that you ask them before you start putting a different color on your wall. Uh, children, we love your children. Uh, your children are wonderful, but we have not provided child care for your children today. You are their child care people. Uh, parents and so please just make sure you know where your kids are now there will be programs out here for children but but it's not like a check-in check-out kind of a deal like you would do at church you're still responsible to know where they are and what they're doing and that they are safe okay now here's what I'd like to do uh, is uh, I'm gonna have our wall leaders again make sure we're spread out make lines now next to each of your wall leaders and then we're going to sort of distribute that out a little bit so so see somebody maybe that you know and line up this direction in front of that person hold your sign up high and so we're starting at that far end with line one and working our way and let's see if we can get these lined up real quick
Oh, you guys are amazing already. This is looking really, really good. Okay, now then, uh, a couple more uh, quick things. Uh, your wall leader uh, is going to assign in just a moment one person to pick up the donuts for your group, and that person is going to pick up the donuts as you go out. Uh, the donuts are over here. Don't go and eat the This is not assigning somebody to eat the donuts. This is assigning somebody to get the donuts to take to your wall where you're going to be painting, so you'll have donuts there. We also will have water here at this station through the course of the day. This is where lunch will be served at 1 o'clock. We're going to have pizza and hot dogs. It's a free lunch. Uh, but as we know, no, there is, it's a free lunch today. You just have to work all day to get it. Great. Now then, remember job number one? Smile. Smile at your neighbor one more time. And then job number two today is do a great job. And really uh, do a wonderful job of painting. We're going to dismiss here by group so we don't get jammed up either at the donuts or uh, on the way out. And so we'll start here with uh, group number six and go ahead and follow your leader towards your wall. And as soon as they make their way out, then group number five, you can follow them. Have a wonderful day painting. As soon as five is out, then uh, uh, four, you can go ahead and follow your group leader and on down the line. Uh, let's, let's have a wonderful day painting, enjoying the opportunity to serve together. And the video you're watching us on uh, TJN, the Jesus Network. It is time to change the planet. And so glad to be uh, streaming uh, live here from Albany, Oregon. And uh, as we come together to bless people in the name of Christ. And Serve Inc. is uh, the name of the organization that's here now. What's your name, sir? Uh, my name is Ed Sweet. I'm a pastor at one of the churches here in town. So talk to us about Serve Inc. Inc. of course means in the name of Christ. And we just listened to your instructions to the group here. What's going on today? Well, two years ago we had Willamette Celebration. And Willamette Celebration was all about really blessing the community. We had concerts and stuff. And we started some work projects then. Well, last year we continued that. And so this is a chance for us to serve in our community. We painted two churches, uh, excuse me, two school buildings last year. Like all over the country, our economy here is depressed. There's not a lot of money, and our school district is struggling. And so by coming together as churches, it gave us a chance to bless the community, to paint some schools, to do what they couldn't do. We saved our school district about $100,000 last year painting schools and, and landscaping as well. And so this is our second year doing that kind of a thing. And so we paint a school here uh, in Albany. We've got another one in Jefferson that we're painting on the inside. Uh, and it's just all about blessing the community. And then this year, we've added the social services and the kids program. And so we want to really serve this part of this neighborhood that is struggling in an extra way, you know, uh, economically, and to provide services for them, to give backpacks to their children for school, to help them to hear the gospel. Praise God. That's one of the things that we want to do as the Jesus Network is go all over the state of Oregon and into Idaho so far, finding out ways that churches and the faith community that are coming together to help serve people. You know, we're supposed to be the hands and feet of Jesus Christ. That's what right. better opportunity that we have right now to serve it? You know, in Hurricane Katrina, uh, the one organization, the organizations that came forward to really save things, 
during Hurricane Katrina was the faith community. Mm -hmm. And during this time of economic depression right now and recession, it's time for, the, for us to be the hands and feet of Jesus Christ once again. Yes, and we love right. to go into organizations and the cities and communities all over Oregon and find out what they're doing to serve. That's right. That's exactly right. And, and, and we're part of a much larger network. Obviously, it's called the Body of Christ. That extends way beyond just Albany. But uh, here in Albany, we get to work together. There are about 20 churches that have come together to do this. About 20 churches that are gathering together today that are working side by side to bless the community. How often do you do this? This is an annual event. This is our, our I guess you could say our third annual event. Uh, we started with the celebration two years ago last year. We did two, two schools. This year we're, we're uh, painting two schools. So we're going to have some music here performed while during lunchtime or what's the it, plan the, there? The music is going to go through the day. Uh, some of it's for adults but a lot of it's just for kids as well. We'll have kid performers, uh, uh, performers for kids to share the gospel. Child Evangelism Fellowship has been a key part of helping set up some program. We've got areas uh, over here for kids to do crafts, uh, friendship bracelets, uh, the, the gospel bracelets, uh, the four or five colors, whatever that's called, <laughs> uh, the wordless book, that, and uh, uh, as well as the bounce houses. We, we're, uh, we have, we're giving away backpacks, and that's going to uh, include a prayer. So it's a backpack and a prayer for every child that wants a backpack. Um, we've got school supplies that go in those. We have free haircuts, we have clothing giveaway, uh, everything we could think of. Well, somebody repairing bicycles, so it's just all in the name of Christ. Amen. Serve in the name of Christ. So as you're watching this online anywhere in the world, it's time we as the body of Christ all join together, different churches, different denominations, to reach out to people in need right now and really serve in the name of Christ. Serve in the name of Christ. I'm Dave Adams with TJN, the Jesus Network. It is time to change the planet right now. Amen. Thank you. Thank you very much. Worthy of 
for a place My heart will sing How great is our God So we're going to be doing some worship music up here. That was just a little sound check. Um, I'm trying to run the sound and sing and play guitar all at the same time. So we did a little sound check there just to kind of see how things were going. We're going to be doing worship music throughout the day. Plus we've got uh, so Pastor Kelly here with uh, magic tricks and and yo-yo ministry. And plus we're going to probably get Tony to sing a couple songs. So we're going to have uh, different things going on up here on the stage throughout the day. Just kind of, uh, you know, 15 minute slots or whatever. And as the Holy Spirit moves. So as we're doing worship music, anybody wants to join in and worship with us, that would be wonderful.
the days of Elijah, declaring the word of the Lord. And these are the days of your servant Moses, righteous and being restored. And though these are days of great trials, of famine and darkness and cold, still we are the voice in the dead. Worthy is the Lamb who 
Check, check, check. Is that it? Check, check. Oh, <laughs> 